Hey guys, Josh here, and welcome to our hard surface jump start for Blender course. Now, before we say anything, this course is free. You don't have to pay anything. It's just uh, a course we made for you guys as a thank you to the community, and hopefully something that helps you guys out, especially if you are a beginner. Now, as you know, we absolutely love teaching you Blender and sharing what we know about this amazing software, and it's always great to see the results that everyone's able to achieve. But one thing we've always felt is missing is a more comprehensive Blender course that is geared towards anyone new to Blender and still getting acquainted with the tools, and that's exactly what this course is about. Now, if you're a seasoned Blender user, you'll still get lots of value out of this course, and we'll discuss why here shortly. So what we've packaged here is a comprehensive, easy to understand, and simple hard surface modeling workflow. You're gonna learn how to make this uh, cool bot. We don't use any add-ons except a few free ones like machine tools, for example, because we really wanna show the fundamentals of how things work natively in Blender. This is exactly what I would've wanted when I first got started in hard surface modeling. So I'm gonna go ahead and pass the torch over to Ryu, the second half of Blender Bros, of course, so we can discuss a bit more about what's inside. Hi guys, Ryu here and let me explain what's inside of the package. There are three main parts this course is divided into. The first one is going to be introduction, second one is modeling and the last one is bonus. Now the introduction is really important and it covers everything from start including Blender installation. So if you're a complete beginner, you're going to be covered, okay? Then we're going to be talking about all the menus, all the options, functions, settings. I'll show you everything the way I have set it up personally for my Blender. I will show you how to install Blender native add-ons that are very useful for hard surface workflow. We're going to talk about basic moves, like how to move something, how to scale something, what to pay attention to. So the entire basics of hard surface modeling and Blender in general, they covered in the introductory videos. Now part two is going to be modeling and then we're going to be modeling sort of like a mobile robotic arm. We're going to be working with booleans. It's a boolean workflow, so not some D workflow, but a boolean workflow. And it's really fun and easy. And we're going to bring this from a cube to a final model, okay? The modeling part also includes rendering, so I will show you all the rendering settings that you need to know. I'm going to show you how to set up a camera, how to set up lighting, how to create a really nice, beautiful render. And then they have a bonus video, so the bonus video is going to be covering the post-processing part, which is really important. So we're going to bring the render into Photoshop and we're going to edit it so it's going to look really amazing on your portfolio. In addition to this, there is a one more a bonus video that's going to be covering Decal Machine, which is a paid add-on. And I just wanted to, to show you how easy it is to add details to a render that's going to be just a concept art, you know, so you just create something really cool for your portfolio and you don't really care about baking details, you just don't have time for this and you want to use decals, it's a fantastic tool for that. Now I'm not using paid add-ons for this course, but I'm going to be using machine tools and power save, both add-ons are free and I will show you in a separate video how to set them up and how to use them. So I'm going to show you the beginner's tools in Vanilla Blender and then I'm going to show you what kind of advantage you have over a vanilla blender when you start using add-ons because eventually the goal is to develop a workflow that is really efficient and these workflows are evolving around add-ons okay guys well that's it thanks so much for watching and hope you will enjoy the course and we really look forward to seeing your renders